Welcome back guys to my ASMR channel. I hope everyone's doing good. Doing well, doing well. Um, <clears throat> as you can tell by the title, we're going to speak about, you know, about, well, you know, my future plans. To say the least. Um, I don't know how, <clears throat> what part of the world you guys are at, but here where I'm at is pretty cold. It's cold outside and um, I'm back in the States. Last two weeks I was in Mexico with uh, my dad and my uh, girlfriend at the time. Now she's my uh, fiance, how you say it. Um, I told her that um, probably next year I will I will I mean probably next year the process of making her legal and for her to be able to come to the United States will be possible obviously because she's with me I'm a US, USA citizen and hopefully everything works out. I hope everything works out. If you guys can send me your blessings, that would be phenomenal. Appreciated. And everything in between, everything in between, everything in between, everything in between, everything in between. How are all of you guys? Are you guys doing well? Are you guys sick? Tell me, please. Because I was sick for a little bit and it was so shitty. But you know, I'm back here in the States. I feel I feel good. Um It sucks how it wasn't wasn't in Mexico for a long time. You know I miss Mexico because I'm not able to see her every day. But um I don't know, like I hope my plans are like by 2026 to have her here so we can like work um, on, our, on our thing, have her back, live with me in my house and find her a job so she can start working and all the other stuff, 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 all the other stuff. The other stuff. Um, but yeah guys, pretty much I have a... Uh, I have a lot of uh, plans, most likely. Um, if you don't pay off my bills, my big bills, and then probably go back and either get my house or probably sell it and buy another one so I can leave here. Um, but you know, <clears throat> as far as uh, as far as Mexico, it was a great time. I had a good time. I don't have any regrets going over there. Um, I enjoyed her company. I enjoyed being with her. Everything was great, awesome, just being with her. And I'll never forget the moments we had. You know, like, I obviously really, um, I really, um, like her as a person. And I, I'm willing to give give it my all to like bring her in the states so she can be with me you know i don't know if you guys know but like as far as like you know fixing her legal status somebody's putting music outside um but uh you know not a lot of people know about that stuff and uh, to this day it's um it can get difficult. It can get difficult. 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 But uh, you know, it, it is what it is. Sometimes I uh, something. Sometimes they put you in a spot for a reason, and it's your decision to like make it out or whatever. Um, but hopefully if, 
if I'm able to, I can like bring her bring her here ASAP. I mean, obviously, I need a I need a lawyer. I have to speak to a lawyer. Um, I already spoke to one, but uh, he didn't really give me a lot of uh, information because he was in a hurry or whatever he was doing. And then uh, when I went to dye my hair, um, the lady's daughter is also doing that because I, I, she told me that her, her, her daughter's boyfriend is in Mexico and then they were able to like fix papers while he waits for a year, yada yada, all that stuff. But, um, but, um, but, 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 I don't know. Really it just depends, I guess. Hopefully everything turns out cool, good for me, and I can start my own family. Because um, I'm not really too lucky here in the states to find a good girl, you know. But more, more, more hopefully I can find something, you know. I can find a possibility. I'll bring her here to the states, in the states, the states, the states, the states. But yeah, guys, that's pretty much my plan. You know get her back, move back to my house, put everything together, start a family, and live together, you know, that's where life is about to change for me, at least for me, at least for me, but, uh, you know, take it little, um, take it slow, by how do they say it, take it step by step, day by day, because before you know it, it'll be Side is pretty cold. It's pretty cold. Pretty cold. Pretty cold. Pretty cold. Um, hopefully tomorrow will be better. Will be more warm. Because I was thinking about going outside, going for a run or something. Because I'm an outdoorsy guy. But it was too cold. Too cold. Too cold. Too cold. In Mexico it was different though. Over there it was way too hot. 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 Because of the jet lag, because man, I've been tired lately, like more than you. 
bushel. I was never this tired in Mexico. Trust me, I don't know why I'm tired here. Tired here, tired here, tired here, tired here. Tired here, tired here. Sometimes I wish, you know, I wish there were like, I could just have a flashback of the future, like what's gonna happen? <laughs> yeah. Oh, okay, so that's gonna happen. Cool. Let me just keep moving forward. But you know, there's no way for me to know. The only thing that you can do probably is control your future and make sure of it, you know? Make sure of it, make sure of it, make sure of it.
make sure you guys get a good night's rest. I don't know what time is it over there, but here's like 9 p.m. So take care, guys. I'll see you in the next one. On the next one.